Soon this will all feel like a distant dream. Until then, may you rest in a deep and dreamless slumber. This is Shannon Woodward, known for playing Elsie, the tenacious, quick-witted, and sometimes impulsive host programmer in Westworld. Shannon's no stranger to television. In fact, according to an extensive 2018 study conducted by me, if you include individual episodes of TV shows, approximately 88.76% of Shannon's career has been in television, with a total of 144 credits at the end of 2017. She's still working on getting her video game numbers up, with a starring role in The Last of Us Part 2. Shannon's very first acting job was in television. When she was around nine years old, she played Missy, a young girl searching for her lost cat, in an episode of the classic Nickelodeon series, Clarissa Explains It All. Oh, Bubblegum, I missed you so much. She even played an alien in another episode. I'm not sure which alien she is, but eh, she's in there, somewhere, one of them. She continued to work as a child actor in several TV movies, then gradually started to play all varieties of teenagers in TV shows. She was perfect as the occasional best friend or passing high school student, but could also be convincing playing extremes, whether she was a boisterous cheerleader in Malcolm in the Middle. Where'd you get the boat? We stole it from our spirit camp. We're going to get cigarettes. Or a rebellious party girl and potential suspect in Without a Trace. Speaking of procedural crime dramas, she guest starred on several of them. And when you're on a crime drama as a guest star, if you're not a victim, you're usually a witness or you're the killer. And in a 2007 episode of Law & Order SVU, Shannon was first a witness and then revealed as a victim and then dun dun dun, the killer. I did everything that you wanted! I love you! In the mid-2000s, Shannon had big breaks as a series regular in two TV shows. First, The Riches, where she played Delilah, the crafty daughter of a family of con artists, and second, in Raising Hope, in which she played Sabrina, the sardonic love interest of the main character, Jimmy. And although Shannon is perhaps more known for her TV work, she's turned in solid performances in films. She played her fair share of secondary characters, but one particular role that highlighted her subtle dramatic work was in the 2010 indie drama Girlfriend friend, in which Evan, a restaurant worker with Down syndrome, becomes infatuated with Shannon's character, Candy. I'm gonna try and pay you back, you know, really soon. Okay? You don't have to. Of course I have to, Evan. I'm if I'm your boyfriend, I have to take care of you. Now, if we were to look at a range of Shannon's TV credits from the time she was on The Riches in 2007 all the way to 2017, that gives us an average of 14.4 projects per year. I'm no mathematician, but if current trends continue, I'm pretty sure sure that by 2050, Shannon Woodward will be starring in every single show on television simultaneously. I'm not sure how that's possible, but she's versatile. She'll figure it out. <laughs>